I'm Carissa from Claymore Wines in the beautiful Clare Valley in South Australia. I am here today to give you a little sneak peek of something that we've had bubbling away in the shed this vintage and to that end I've invited our beautiful winemaker Emma to join me to have a chat about what she's brought in in the dodgy bottle. If you can read it, you might just happen to say Claymore 2020 Rosé. Over to you and what is it that you have in the glass for me? It's 2020 Claymore Wines Rose Bay. <laughs> um, I'm very so, obvious. Yeah, so this is a uh, under the label of Whole Lot of Love. Awesome. And it's a Pinot Noir Rose. There'll be a lot of people out there very happy to hear of the return of the Whole Lot of Love. But Pinot. Yes. Why, why Pinot? It was completely unplanned. We just found a stunning, gorgeous block that just screamed rosé and yeah it just was intuitively what we knew we wanted to do straight away when we saw it um, it was probably some of the best fruit that we had seen all year and yeah it was so pretty in the vineyard and it's just carried right through to you know almost finished and has always just been really stunning and a favourite of ours. Okay. Now I said dodgy bottle you've said almost finished that's obviously not ready for the every man to drink What's going on with it right now? Yep. So um, it's just finished fermentation. So that's still, we've left it on lees for a, a short while, which um, is proving to show a lot of creaminess. So it's on the palate, it's looking very much like wild strawberries and cream with a hint of spice. So yeah, it's still got a bit of a savory edge, but um, and then, but very fruit driven on the nose. So lots of pink grapefruit and a really lovely minerality of like sea spray and, and yeah, white flower florals. So nice and dry. Very excited. Though. Yeah, nice and dry. Definitely. So nice. this has been something of your baby. I know you've been, Emma's been really excited about this from the start. When do you reckon we're gonna get a chance to get it cleaned up bright and shiny and punters out there can get a hold of it? I would uh, think that probably it will be in bottle and ready for release in about three weeks so <laughs> three weeks from this to something pristine guys keep your ears and eyes open i will be letting you know um,